so we're back west again. Uh, we've been back here pretty frequently since um, we had that problem with the noxious weeds and losing some calves. It's fly season back here, guys. It's, I got one stuck to my glasses right now I'm trying to get off. So I'm going to follow Glenn in with the quad and he's going to do some pan spraying. And this is just uh, one of those opportunities that we have because we're not paying this year. It would be something that we couldn't do if we had to pay. That's our first gate. And if we go up here a little ways and then hang a right, behind these bushes up here is kind of a nice little flat spot that opens up to this ridge and we used to camp up here. I don't know. Or maybe you want the quad. I'm going this way. Along this side of it. Like right up here. So we're gonna go up these little water runs and uh, scout for bad weeds. Just off kind of the top hop right here. I don't happen to see what we're looking for. Whoa, there's lots happening on the pond down there. I don't know if you can see all those birds. Holy cow, ducks all over the place. Gorgeous. <clears throat> when we came up to move cows across the road, just right here was the last time we saw a grizzly up here. That was almost three weeks ago now. They could be moved on and long gone. Or they could just be having a nap in the bush and you don't know till you wake them up. There's a bit of a breeze back here and I just took the quad, I scouted out uh, where we're gonna be going and so I can take the truck, which is good. I feel more comfortable having the truck nearby and then I can stay really close to Glen. And uh, there's a nice breeze which, like I said, it's fly season back here. I just sprayed myself with uh, off, deep woods off. However, uh, they sometimes don't care. Last time I was up here, they were biting me through my thick shirt, so. And uh, anyway, yeah, so we're gonna get started. When you use the hand sprayer like that, you can be really specific to the plant so that it doesn't affect the surrounding plants. There's no water running through these things this year, so it's a that's probably the problem, but it's also a good time to uh, look and get any weeds that we can because there's no risk of it running off.
we're nearing uh, the edge of our property following this one uh, sort of water system up and like that's just about as close to that top of that ridge as we can get from here it's just so beautiful hey yeah awesome I can smell some mint. I must have just drove through a patch of mint. You can see the highway is way over there where we have to come in. That's just Glenn traipsing around in the bush. I hope. <laughs> she says with nervous laughter. Wouldn't that be a view to wake up to and have your morning coffee? We don't do this anymore, but we should. <laughs>